Co-reasoning. How to use AI as a thinking partner, not a shortcut. We've all heard the phrase, work smarter, not harder. But in the age of artificial intelligence, that's not enough anymore. The real challenge now is learning how to think smarter with the machine. See, most people use AI like a vending machine. They type a question, hit enter, and hope something valuable drops out. But that's not how intelligence works. Not human, not artificial. If you treat AI as a shortcut, it will make you shallow. If you treat it as a thinking partner, it will make you sharper. AI's real potential isn't in doing your thinking for you. It's in doing your thinking with you. That's what I call co-reasoning, a back-and-forth process where human judgment and machine logic refine each other. Think about the old Socratic dialogues. Socrates didn't hand people answers. He questioned them into clarity. AI, when used the right way, can do the same thing. It can debate you, challenge you, push you to articulate what you actually believe. But only if you invite it to. Let's make this practical. Imagine you're trying to develop a new business strategy. Instead of asking, what's the best way to grow my business? Here's my current strategy. Argue against it. Show me what I'm missing. Now you're not just prompting for information. You're engaging in structured disagreement. You're creating friction. And friction reveals truth. You can even ask it to take different perspectives. Argue this from a customer's point of view, now from a competitor's, now from an investor's. Each time you're broadening your frame, you're not outsourcing your thinking, you're upgrading it. Here's a simple framework I use called the idea loop. Start by asking an open-ended question. That's inquire. Then tell AI to challenge or expand on your idea. That's debate. Next, look at both sides and test the logic. That's evaluate. Finally, decide what insight to carry forward. That's apply. The beauty of this loop is that it forces you to stay engaged. You're not letting AI think alone. You're thinking with it. And something powerful happens when you start doing this regularly. You begin to see your reasoning patterns. You start recognizing where you jump to conclusions, where you ignore counterarguments, and where your beliefs quietly steer the outcome. AI becomes a mirror, not just for your ideas, but for your logic. It doesn't judge you, it reflects you. You can even tell it, analyze my argument and list my hidden assumptions. Or, show me the weakest link in my reasoning. Those aren't easy requests to make. They require humility. But they lead to the kind of growth no shortcut can provide. Here's the trap. The more convenient AI gets, the more tempting it is to let it do the heavy lifting. To say, just summarize this, or just write that. But the problem with outsourcing thought is that you also outsource understanding. Real intelligence comes from wrestling with the problem, from seeing how each piece connects. Co-reasoning keeps you in that space. It transforms AI from a tool into a thinking gym, a place to train your cognitive muscles. And just like in a gym, the weight is what makes you stronger. The more you push your ideas against AI's reasoning, the clearer your thinking becomes. You stop fearing disagreement. You start seeking it. Because every time you ask AI to argue with you, you're really learning to argue with yourself. And that's where the breakthroughs happen. So, if you've been using AI to save time, try using it to expand time. The kind of time that deepens your understanding instead of just shortening your task list. Ask it to debate you. Ask it to explain your idea back to you. Ask it to merge two opposing perspectives into one coherent vision. That's not automation. That's evolution. The best thinkers of this century won't be the ones who know the most facts. They'll be the ones who know how to think in partnership with intelligence. AI doesn't replace curiosity, it rewards it. And curiosity, combined with critical thinking, is what separates the creators from the consumers in this new world. So don't chase the perfect answer. Chase the perfect question. And let AI challenge you into clarity.